I can imagine why this would be hard for you, honey. Seeing Steffi and Liam living together as a family. But this is what Hope wanted. I mean, you wanted Liam to be with the girls full time. Mitch, it's still hard for her. I mean, I, I can see that. I'm, I'm hoping it will get easier with time. It will get easier. And I, for one, am proud of you. Your strength and your integrity for putting the girls first. They're what's important. It is. And it's for the best. I keep telling myself that. Don't be so hard on yourself. It's okay for you to be feeling the way that you're feeling. It's normal. That's the thing, Mom. I don't know how I'm feeling. It keeps changing from one minute to the next. Sweetie, you've suffered a lot of loss in the last few months. First your daughter, then your marriage, and now Emma. Look, I, I don't want you to force yourself to go over to stuff. I'm not forcing myself to go. If I didn't want to, I wouldn't. And I know how much it means to Douglas and Thomas for me to be there, and I want to be a part of the girls' lives, and besides, isn't this what it was all about anyway? You know, one big, happy, extended family. And that's exactly what it's gonna be. Well, maybe. But you have to give yourself some time. You have to be patient with yourself. I want to move on. And I am trying really hard to be okay with all of this. And if all this loss has taught me one thing, it's that life is precious. So it's time I start living mine again. You're hearing that, right? Yes. It's the right attitude. You have a lot of support around you, people who love you, me and Rich, the rest of the family. We're all here for you, sweetheart. That includes Thomas and Douglas. You've had a huge impact on that little boy. I'm grateful for that. So is my son.